Well, this is about as decorated a kickboxer as has come into this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship-level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things from as close as you can get. He's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive knees into your body. But it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes him truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxing, the high level yeah. one, from everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem Abdul-Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you could do that, you could do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Struve is one year the elder. He weighed in at 265 pounds. He will have a 12-inch reach advantage. All right, now for the official Ladies introductions, we go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffett. The main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer, holding a professional record of 33 wins, 13 losses. He stands seven feet tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Body out of Beaverwick, the Netherlands. Stefan Skyscraper! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, give me the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out for The fighters touch him up. Talked about his reach advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. Nice punch by Lee. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Edge of your seat action as expected so far. Nice defense there. Huge block. Well, you can feel that breeze octagon side after the swing and a miss by Stroop. Body kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Big kick land. Swing and a big miss by 
Nice true. Oh, nice slip, and then the counter for him there. And I know DC's inner monologue is, man, can I just be the longer fighter in one UFC matchup? I get it, man. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Big ball from punch land. Now he gets back to range. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Checks that leg kick. Throwing that jab, no good. He is all about that left kick to the body. Visibly limping here. Nice punch there by the sky. Stephen so once again, making good use of his size as he lands the knee. Struve gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can wrap. Well, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. Oh, nice job with the knee strike there. That'll wake you up. He thought it would be available. He just knew he had to find the right time to throw it. That was the right time. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Good punch. All right, so he continues to use his jab effectively here, DC. He gets that hand to the target pretty quickly. I mean, just right away, blasting the jab after jab after jab. He is a phenomenal boxer with a vast understanding of fighting behind that educated jab. Lee gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Excellent land by him there with the uppercut. If he had changed the angle, that could have been a knockdown. I mean, he threw every part of himself into that strike. Well, we talked about that reach advantage as you see him land the straight punch there. Great job using his length in that situation. Nice punch land on the top. Big body kick. And now he's got that tight punch. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh, beautifully placed in time kick there by Stroop. I need you to kick now. Oh, nice job to land a knee to the body. Man, I wish I was that tall. Overhand attempt now. It's blocked by Stroop. All right, so he continues to land that jab. His opponent said he was ready for it, but doesn't appear to be. You're not ready until you're in there. You can watch all the film you want. You can spar as much as you want, but until you feel a guy with a fast jab like this, you don't understand the precision of that punch. He gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Oh, big left hand there. Drew's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. Back and forth we go. Time, time, time. What are you doing out there? Let's shake it off. We need to do exactly what we did in the gym. Keep your hands up. Keep moving your head. Keep moving your feet. Cut those angles. And let's just... Come on, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC. And uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding, and look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent. And as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him. That was so impressive to see. Someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Punch there by Lee. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. There. And every one of them are landing. He's overwhelming him with different attacks. Swing and a miss by Lee. How good is that right hand? Oh, and he lands.
lands yet another knee. And sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're gonna sit there at the drive through <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, Give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook. That's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man. Let this guy have the whole thing. Well, you saw us reference it in the tail of the take, DC. He's got the reach advantage and certainly made good use of it there in landing that jab. Try to establish that jab. Lee gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Right, Trying to do damage now with the kick. That's a miss. Lee gets hit with that hook. He's got to be careful here. Just over three minutes to go. Oh, man, his leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see his opponent starting to slow down. He cannot take many of those kicks. Well, at this point, he's got to be way up on the judges' scorecards, clearly winning the fight, and largely he's gotten a double the strike. He got it done with the strike. He fought well behind the jab, but it was a significant strike that really did make an impact on the judges' mind. Strew moves forward with a nice kick. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Slips. Oh, misses with the jab. Struve's lower jaw very swollen now. Time to bite down on the mouthpiece and move forward. It out. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this? Telegraph that spinning back fist. Oh, and he just keeps on coming with these shots to the liver, looking to buckle him once again. Buckled him earlier in the fight, and the fighter is still open to damage there as he continues to... Oh, one of the best head kicks you'll ever see! You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on the feet right now. Needs a big knee! Big body kick land. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. Oh, that's a good knee to the body there by Lee. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. Good jab. Big head kick lands. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Misses with the left hook. Nice right hand. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Oh! Final seconds here of round number two. Look at the four behind that leg kick. All right, so leg kicks on, leg kicks, the big storyline in that round. DC, take us through the replay. Man. Yeah, he was, I mean, what a display of high-level striking. What a display of getting the leg to the target very, very quick. So quick that your opponent cannot react. Great job.
right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks go, guys, in the fight. previous round and he'll look to keep it going here. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Effective punch there by Lee. He blocks the punch. Way to hide that leg. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, nice offering there with the knee. He talked to us a lot about that on Thursday. Felt like the knees would be there. It was certainly there on that exchange. He knew they would be available. Just two, he would have to find the right opportunity and right time to land those strikes. Right under the elbow. Straight punch lands. Side leg kick. Lee's head kick is blocked, so no damage inflicted there. How about that shin? He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Leg kick thrown. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Connects with the right. Just out of range with the straight left hand. All right, so he lands a jab there. Pretty nicely done, DC. You can really control a fight just knowing how to fight behind your jab. He loaded up with that right hand, too. Whiffs on the right hand. Shroom's overhand punch to the head. Doesn't get to the target. Did he telegraph that one and it gets blocked? Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds. And it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. Gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Stru. Head kick. A swing and a miss by the skyscraper, Stefan Stru. Look at him working at trying to set the liver down. Big leg kick land. Big head kick lands. Oh, he landed another great shot to the body. They're really starting to connect at a high percentage now in the latter stages of this fight. Beautiful kick. Lands flush with that right hand. Huge block there. Struve going for the leg kick. He does not connect. Nice punch, Lance. Over and over, he's landing a big body. Kick. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Lee. Pretty significant well on the left side. Oh! He's hurt. Fighter's pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you gotta be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. Man, this is some serious ground and pound here, DC. He's not just staying busy for the sake of staying busy. These strikes are doing damage. Oh, yeah, no pity pass to this guy. Ah. This guy's trying to land, and he's trying to land effective strikes. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. His opponent squirming like a fish out of water now. The ground and pound is on point. This could very well be the beginning of the end. This could be the beginning of the end. We've seen some really good ground and pound fighters. 
This young man is as good as any we've ever seen. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action, but the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed that put him on wobbly legs and then survival mode. Luckily, he made it to the end of that round. Are you ready? You ready? Fourth round, fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. What a punch. Strew gets absolutely punished by that head kick. And he landed the right hand there. Can't take many of those, you better check. Left-right combo is good. Oh, setting up the left hook, but out of range. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Real speed by the Look at him dig that body shot right up to his opponent's third. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, nice right hand. Very nice leg kick there by Lynn. Oh, effective strike there by Strew. Well, you didn't see a lot of the body work from him in the earlier rounds, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. Beautiful body. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Leg Back kick. and forth we go. Just over three minutes to go. Big punch lands through the middle. Well, you're starting to see the damage now bleeding from his cheek. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Big body kick lands under the elbow. Boy, Thai plump. All right, lands a kick there. Pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. Well, late in the fight, and clearly it's been a dominant performance for him, and he's had to lean on that cardio. It certainly has not abandoned him tonight. Cardio in the video game comes down to who's button mashing and who's actually playing the game. The guy that's actually <laughs> playing the game has better cardio. Look at that bar. Stop button pressing and learn how to play the game. Nice punch there by Strew. Real quick leg kick. Oh, and he caught the kick. And now he's got that tie clinch. We'll see what he can do with it. Oh, looked like he was trying to set up the head kick, but he misses on that attempt. Under two minutes now to go in the round. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Nice head kick. Nice knee to the body there by Strew. Powerful leg kick lands. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. Nice leg kick lands. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Man, look at the size of that bruising on his body. Oh. All right, so there he goes, continuing to land that jab. When they put this highlight together, it's just going to be one head snapping back. It's going to be boxers going back and watching this guy going, wow, this is what a jab is supposed to look like. Just missing on the uppercut there.
real sneaky head kick gets in there. Big leg kick lands. 30 seconds to go in this one. Just misses with the jab. Oh, here comes the kick. That one got by the skyscraper, Stefan Struve. Oh, 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 this fight's gonna be over. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high. He was going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Great, one more strikes. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights he has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead, and I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and that's something like this start to take their time. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick. And watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. All right, then a left. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Able to land to the body there with the left kick. Nice, sneaky head kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Nice body kick. Trying to establish that jab once again. What a body kick. Strew gets caught with that punch. Gotta shore up the defense here. Get those combinations. Nice kick there by Lee. Well placed with the kick. Right torso starting to bruise pretty good here. Just missed with that right hand. Real nice body kick. Man. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Great punch landing with so much power. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Place kick there by Strew. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. All right, well, it's late in the fight. Time is of the essence. And when you're clearly losing and you know you need a finish, risk. Oh! He's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch right down the pipe. It's unreal. That was a thudding leg kick. Two minutes now to go in this one. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Big head kick. Going through the body, missed with that kick. Able to check the high kick. Nice loop of punch. The kick is there to the body. Now connects with the right. Fourth we go. 
miss with that jab attempt there. Oh, man, head kick lands. So we go under a minute to go in the fight. There's no tell on that leg kick. Nice punch there. Beautiful body kick lands right under the elbow. Lands the right hand. Oh, blocks the shot. Big kick lands. Just misses with the straight right. 30 seconds to go. Twenty seconds to go in the fight. There's no kill. Oh! Oh! I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he is on Beach Street right now. He's seeing Tweety Bird over the top of his head. When you take a hook like that, you are on wobbly legs. That was snuck in. Nice strike. What a fight! All right, so the fight goes the distance as we await the judges' scorecards, but certainly a dominant striking effort out of that fighter tonight. John, he used his best weapons in order to carry him to a decision, a very clear decision, in my opinion. A great performance tonight by this young fighter. Official decision is now in. Here is Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 50 45. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, congratulations to him. He is your winner by unanimous decision and certainly a dominant performance here tonight. Yeah, he did a great job of just dictating and controlling all the engagements of this.